Hey there, welcome to another episode of Home Note with me in the kitchen space. In today's episode, let's make a beef stew or a beef fry. And I'm pretty sure you're going to love this once you try it out. With me here, I have my ingredients. And from this corner, I have some soy sauce because we definitely have some meat. I have my beef that is already chopped. I have some capsicum, some coriander stems, some coriander leaves. I have my seasonings. And with me here, I have some beef cubes. I have some rico powder. I have some paprika. And finally, I have some curry powder. I also have some salt, garlic, tomato paste, ginger, and some onions. And without further ado, let's get started. Once my pan is hot enough, I'll go in with about a tablespoon of cooking oil. And once that is also hot, I'm going with my onion. So I'm going to cook my onions till they start turning translucent and then I'll be back. Now that this is how I like it, I'll go in with my ginger. Then I'm also going to add in my coriander stems. And now that the ginger is break run, I'll go in with my beef. Then I'm going to cover this for about two minutes so that the beef can start releasing its juices. You can see that this is doing okay. And just to mention, I find that this uh, way of cooking gives very flavorful beef as compared to the other where you start by like, boiling it. Then I'm going to add in my tomato paste. Oh, and you can see that this looks yummy already. I'm also going to add in my capsicum because I want them to be cooked. As well as my garlic. Then I'll add in some water. You can see that this already looks yummy. Then it's at this point that I'll go in with my spices because I want this to be very flavorful. I'll add that and also add this. Then I'm going to mix that. Thank you. 
Then I'm going to add more water. Then I'll proceed to cook this for about 20 or so minutes till my beef is ready. So this has been going on for about 10 minutes now. I'm here to taste the salt. It's good. Then I'm going to add some soy sauce. You can add as much as you like or as little as you prefer. Then I'm going to taste the salt. So remember our spices in have some salt and soy sauce also has some salt so from the look of things i'm not going to be adding any more salt instead i'm going to add more water so that my beef can be completely turned up by the time it's done and i'm going to give this about 10 more minutes then everything should be ready So it's been a total of about 22 23 minutes there about and you can see that the water has greatly reduced and it's such a nice thick paste i have already tasted and i'm happy with the dennis so once you are happy with the dennis of your beef just how you like it this is ready to be fished off and you can see how gorgeous this looks i'll garnish it with my coriander leaves This looks amazing. Then I'm going to cover this and I'll see you for serving. So finally, our stew is ready and let's give this a taste test. I've stabbed mine with some terere, I have some avocado and some ugali and I also have an ugali recipe. You can check that out. You can appreciate how thick it is. Mm, 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 mm. This is so good. This is such a legit recipe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And some avocado. Mm. Lovely. So let's taste the whole combination. Mm. 
that's pretty much it for today's episode i hope you enjoyed you just have to try this recipe don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you haven't and i'll see you in the next one bye